Portraits of the 58 lives cut short during the 1 October tragedy were unveiled today. They're actually part of a memorial exhibit at the Clark County Government Center. 8 News Now reporter Orko Manon joining us now in studio with a pretty emotional reveal earlier today, Orko. Yeah, Denise, the 58 portraits depict each of the victims as they would want to be remembered, loving parents, siblings, and spouses. Their faces are a way for their families and the community to heal. The Las Vegas Portraits Project has been working on this for nearly a year. Artists from around the world created the portraits, each one just as unique as the person they depict. The goal of the project is to inspire hope and healing for all those affected by the tragedy. I spoke to Mary Jo Von Tillo. She lost her husband, Kurt, in the shooting. She says his portrait is picture perfect. We called him Captain America. So to have this flag in the background and think about singing God Bless America with Big and Rich and the whole audience moments before he, he passed away is just powerful. And this portrait will always remind me of that night. The 1 October Memorial exhibit also includes the crosses that were put up at the Welcome to Las Vegas sign to honor those who died. Now, the Las Vegas Portraits Project is on the first floor rotunda of the Clark County Government Center. It will be on display through October 19th.